Hi y'all. Uh, today we're going to be unboxing. This is the brand new uh, HP Star Wars Special Edition laptop. Uh, this laptop right here is Energy Star certified, so that comes right on the handle. This is the other side of the laptop box, so you get something really cool. A little lightsaber there. We have entered the dark side. <laughs> so we're going to open it up here. And we're going to check out what it is. This was a custom ordered laptop. This laptop has uh, a two terabyte hard drive, eight gigabytes of RAM, and a N40 something uh, Nvidia uh, card there that has dedicated graphics. So we'll read it all off to you. So here's some of the literature that comes with it. Uh, technical support, startup lines, um, about the content included with it. You get a Star Wars Command Center, double click the Imperial icon on the desktop to launch the Star Wars Command Center where you can browse the content, galleries, adjust themes, choose from a selection of wallpaper collections and screensavers, and select photos displayed in the wallpapers. In addition, we have included the trailers from several Star Wars films. And so there's the photo gallery and uh, the recycle bin. Is The Death Star icon is now your recycle bin. This is what it looks like That's when it's awesome. empty. Oh, yeah, what it looks like when it's full. It is awesome. <laughs> and then oh, you the get... destroyed Death Star means it's like full or something? Em empty. Or destroyed? <laughs> empty and full. So. Nice. And then the Star Wars comic from Marvel. So you get Star Wars comics oh, wow. and a one year membership to Fandor, a hand picked collection of the most talked about independent films from around the world streaming to your desktop, mobile device, and TV. So you get a free year of also uh, streaming mobile movies. Interesting. So here's the setup guide for it. Kind of easy peasy here. You plug it into the wall, you put the battery in, you do all this stuff, and you turn it on. So, and then how to scroll, how to do your different um, swipe functions here, or gestures, if you want to call them that. Gestures, it's a better word for it. Uh, with, with your fingers, a pinching the two things, you know. <laughs> Unless you haven't had a laptop before. And then there's a little little box here of stuff. And this this has me curious. So before we open the computer, I've got to see what the heck this is. Oh! It's just the cord. And it's the battery. So if I will write the startup guide here, I wouldn't know that. But look at this neat collectible box. Like, this would be good for some Magic the Gathering cards, if you like Magic the Gathering. Yeah, they actually used to have a Star Wars TCG, but I don't know if they still make that. Really? Yeah, this would be good to put some collectible cards in. So all I'm thinking is like a Magic the Gathering. That's a cool little picture of Darth Vader on the front. Maybe That's some... definitely a keeping box. Yeah, this is definitely, a, it's heavy, it's nice, and it has like a magnetic oh, wow. thing to it's it. Like... So yeah, it's a collector's box. And that looks about it, except for a packaging slip here, um, our customer packaging slip, which tells us all about, yeah, what's on this computer. So this is the one for $9.99, but if you look around and Google, like, um, there's so many coupon sites, like Retail Me Not, and there's another one too out there. Just start Googling uh, HP coupons. So I managed to get a good HP coupon. I got like 25% off of this computer. It dropped it down to like 700 something dollars. Uh, so anyways, this comes with a backlit keyboard, security software trial, uh, 8 gigabytes of RAM, uh, 802.11 BGN WLAN and Bluetooth, office software trial, it's a 15.6 full HD uh, display, uh, it's also touch screen, Windows 10, an HD webcam with a dual mic, a four cell lithium ion battery, a super multi DVD burner, and Intel i 665,000 or whatever, 6,500 uh, processor with NVIDIA GeoForce N40, uh, two gigabytes. So it has two gigabytes of dedicated graphics, a two terabyte hard drive, uh, and something 3C15 cycle AV. So this is basically what comes in this computer. It has all the bells and whistles. It's the top of the line model that they are selling. So let's see how she runs and what she looks like. Let's take these little doodads off here. Where one is it? Hat. She can watch your video. <laughs> I'm playing. This one could be a collar. <laughs> I'll start dressing, <laughs> making some fashion designs out of the little foam. That's the nerd geek in me, I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> okay. Smells new. 
I smell it, cameraman. He's like, it's got kind of almost like that Magic the Gathering pack smell when you open it. He's like over there, like, oogling over it. So let's put the battery in. Battery's in. On the back here, it says... Three hours later. No. Sorry, <laughs> my nails are wet, so I <laughs> didn't want to hurt them. So it says Lucasfilm LTD on the back. You use these to lock and move your battery around. The front of the computer has something neatly written here. Looks like it's in another language. Star That's Wars. Star Wars language. Yes, I know it is. And you got, uh, when you are flipping it open, you got Darth Vader and the HP logo. So let's see. You got a nice little handy dandy uh, screen protector thing thingy. Let's turn her on. See how much uh, juice. Showcase that keyboard. Yeah, look at the keyboard. It's very nice. Got some stormtroopers. Look at that. If you got stormtroopers, look at the colors. It's very beautiful. They, look, these are all your keys right here. You turn on your backlit keyboard is red, as you can see. It's a nice red. Nice. Intel Core i7, like I said, top of the line model here. I think they're on maybe a fifth or sixth generation i7, so it's it's up there. Last computer poor cameraman had is uh, his computer was like what 2012, so this is a three years in the making. This is going to be his. <laughs> so we're just waiting for startup to load. So it takes a few moments usually with new computers or any computer when you're rebooting it uh, from factory settings. If you've ever reformatted a computer, um, we repair computers a lot. So when you're reformatting them or rebooting them like that, it, it takes them a few minutes to warm up because they're going through all the configuration settings. So play your Jeopardy music while you wait. <laughs> but you can tell it's working. Do one of those cool camera effects where it speeds it up. Yeah, I know, like, I'll talk Time like, lapse. <laughs> Time lapse me. I'm sure you're doing 500 different tests in yeah, like I know. two seconds. <laughs> it seems like they're all becoming touchscreen. I just got one, uh, a touchscreen that's HP. Uh, maybe about in June or July because my computer was old too, so. It still drives me crazy. Like I tell people, don't touch the screen. It's like everyone wants to touch the screen now. They're like, oh, look at this. And it's like, boink, they touch the screen. There you go. Uh, the legal stuff, except, yes, yes. Lily Sizzling TV Show. Yes, that is our network here. And let's enter my secret password. Or I'll turn it around so you can't stroller surf me. There we go. Checking network requirements. It's going to sign on. And we're going to be connected here. And we'll just use Express settings for now and I'll go back and reconfigure it. So let's just take a look here. I want to see what it looks like. I want to put something in the recycle bin and do the Death Star thing real quick. <laughs> that seems fun. I, I've always said that the recycling bin needs replaced anyway. What? The recycling bin. It's been around forever. It does, yeah. I think it's a different icon there. Yeah. You can customize icons though. Yeah. But that's cool. That comes standard with with a customizable icon. I like the idea of a blown up Death Star. Yeah, that's really cute. That's still tripping the fanboy in me. Yeah. Just a moment. <laughs> You're on hold again. When the computer crashes, it should flash an image of Alderaan being exploded. <laughs> Flash something. The whole planet just exploding. Space balls. Oh no no no! <laughs> <laughs> Don't get me started pointing <laughs> that. Have you seen her? There goes the planet. <laughs> Shit! They found plaid. You just <laughs> getting critical updates. Since when did this happen in the movie? This is happening Terminator now, laptop. now. <laughs> We're about ready to, ready to go. <laughs> I'm hoping my next computer will be All Skynet I can hear is Spaceballs now. Ah, uh, gotcha. They need a Spaceballs computer. Oh, buckle this. Every time, yeah, every time you hit a button, it does something <laughs> yeah. stupid. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I 
the yeah. space bodies. They changed the Quiddy board backwards. Watch out. Watch out. <laughs> Why have you found one coming in the desert? We ain't found shit. <laughs> I'm gonna go through the whole movie while this is like going through. I can quote. It's jammed. <laughs> the radar, sir, it appears to be jammed. One cool feature about this is I noticed the text on the keys is a little different. Yeah. Than standard HP. Yeah, it's just, it looks, looks like Star Wars. Kind of Star Wars. Yeah, futuristic or whatever. Yeah. That's kind of a neat feature. It is. Don't These keys, because I have the same computer, I can tell you that they all do something. Like this is escape, help. Uh, this turns down the screen, turns up the screen, it lets you brighten it. I don't press that one much. That's like your um, like the which back uh, version of Windows does this one come with? Uh, ten. They skip nine and right right to ten. So this is ten. Wow. They can do that. They have the technology to go straight to ten. Yep. It what happened to, to nine? It goes to eleven. So this is. Are we your watching ten now? Volume, yeah, volume buttons. And this one right here what happened to nine? is the airplay mode. If you really want to mess with someone, just press this and they won't figure out why their computer isn't connecting to the internet. Like, what? <laughs> we passed nine. We're now on ten now. Exactly. We passed it. When? Just now. Go back to then. When? <laughs> <laughs> This is happening now, now. Geek! I know, it's terrible. We watched that movie for about 6,000 miles a dozen times over in the back seat of the car. They're screaming kids. I shockingly On have, an iPad. <laughs> I have a six-year-old daughter, and she loves space balls. So she quotes it, and she's, she can <laughs> quote it word for word. And her favorite quote, which is funny coming from the mouth of a six-year-old, is, Get back here, you fat bearded bitch! <laughs> and she, bless her heart, she has a nice teacher and all, but her, her teacher's heavy set. And I, I was thinking, oh man, the first time her teacher puts her in timeout, I'm going to get that call that she's saying that, because she, <laughs> she has said that to her grandmother before when she got mad. So, <laughs> we had a teacher not... <laughs> quote the movie, you know, to, to people like that, but that's your favorite quote. My brother's a big Star Wars fan. Yeah, he likes Star Wars and she likes space balls, so. Okay, make it yours, your Microsoft account. Oh, goodness. That's like that I have to create a new one, do I? Now that I've entered his email address and password, he's like, cut, because you're going to give everyone my email address and password. <laughs> Oh, okay. Set a pin. We'll set a pin. Cut. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, what's the combination to the to the air shield the computer? One, two, three, four, five. It's a okay, meet save Cortana. I have one Cortana is luggage. your sidekick ready to help you with anything that keeps you super heroic or on time. Let Cortana do her best work. Microsoft collects. This is kind of like that. What's the thing that you use for it? Droids. No, that thing on... um. On the iPhone there. I don't ever use it. Like, thing that talks Siri to or whatever? Siri, yeah. I never use it. I don't get it. I'm too I'm so sorry. ancient. I need to update myself. So Cortana sounds like she's like Siri. Mr. D is like 50 years old, and he uses that all the time. <sighs> yeah, I have a 50-year-old friend who uses it, and I'm like, what? Okay, no, we don't want to share contact. HP cannot send your contact. Blah, 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 blah. No, we don't want HP to send anything. Thank you. We get enough spam in our email box. This is taking forever to set up. It takes a few days. And then I'll do all the nerdy stuff and remove bloatware, set the user access controls, and now I won't show you guys how to do all that in one video. It's, it's a lot. I'll trick it out. It is time lapse this footage. This won't take long. It's taken long it's enough. A, it says this won't take long. Seriously. It's a killer computer, but it just... It's just Windows. With all this. So now it says it's taking care of a few things. So, don't turn off your PC. So, it's still loading. 
But we were just talking about um, some of the different Star Wars uh, storylines. He was talking about cloning technology, right? Yeah. My personal favorite was the Force Unleashed storyline. I, I agree with you. Not a lot of people like that, but I, I really got in the Force Unleashed one. That, that was good. I liked the character there. Star Killer. Yeah, he was cool. I liked watching you guys play I, the video games and watching that. There's a neat little scenes. love thing going on with the, his little pilot there. Yeah. So here I he thought is. it was a great idea. It's loaded, and he it's thinks cute. that Darth Vader will be brought back by cloning technology. That's his assumptions, right? Yeah, that's one of my ideas. There's a Kilo Ren as your default backdrop. Congratulations. To get the most out of your new HP, blah, blah, blah. I usually don't do the bloatware type stuff. So this is basically it. The Star Wars trailers, the library, <laughs> the command, the comic, the Fandor, and the recycle bin. So That's pretty neat. I'm going to make like a folder real quick and put in the recycle bin so we can watch what happens. No more naked chicks. I, uh, half naked art. Yeah, his computer's so perverse. <laughs> he has like half naked art of like Catwoman or something being tied up by Joker or something. And it's like you can see her. It's like not, not very appropriate for a backdrop. Ah, there's the recycle bin. Now it's full. It's full. <laughs> awesome. You've repaired the Death Star. I've repaired it. Blow it up again. Empty it. Blow. There we go. So there you have it. And, and all of our nerdy hey. talk. And she's broken again. Yep. Yeah. The new HP Star Wars Special Edition laptop. And this is the customized edition if you're just now scrolling to the end of the video. Uh, with the two terabyte hard drive and the eight gigabytes of RAM and all those bells and whistles and the two gigabytes of dedicated graphics. And that's that's the selling side right there is dedicated graphics because if you play a lot of RPGs or MMORPGs basically uh, and you do that type of nerdy stuff, like I play World of Warcraft, so all my computers have to have dedicated graphics. Star Wars, the old republic. Yeah, I know, we do play that too. I play that with Caden. Uh, I have some video tutorials of us playing that. I play, we play Star Wars, the old republic. We play World of Warcraft, uh, Hearthstone, all those types of games. So we have just tons of like little RPGs, my, Minecraft. We, we do it all. We like to play our games. So the best systems I find uh, laptop wise if you can't get a physical like a, a good tower and you don't want to carry a tower with you want something portable is don't go with anything with a uh, with like those like HD graphic cards or whatever you have to get dedicated get dedicated graphics get better performance on your computer longer life on your computer too so here it is and uh, I hope you all enjoy this video and uh, go check it out, go check it out, get your uh, Star Wars uh, computer here. Uh, Black Friday's coming up in uh, November and um, Black Friday will probably have some good deals on these guys. I'd probably get them before they're gone. Uh, I ordered this when the pre-orders came out, it was like maybe October 18th or so and it's now the end of October. So it took a good two weeks almost to get here. Um, so you want to order it early. I wouldn't order it past December 1st if you're going to do customized. Uh, that way you can get in time for Christmas. So uh, come watch us uh, do other things too. We like to cook. Uh, Sizzletastic.com And uh, you can come like my Facebook page, facebook.com backslash Sizzletastic. And subscribe, like our channel. Uh, come see some of our cooking videos too. And uh, we'll, we cook up things all the time. So we cook and we unbox and we do a bunch of good stuff. So bon appetit and see y'all later. <laughs>